thanks so much uh, to all of you that uh, took part in our hashtag Ask Louise, um, where you were kindly posting your skin health questions to me to be answered um, via video on our mainly Instagram, but uh, we had quite a few coming through from our other social media uh, channels as well, so thank you. One of the ones that kind of really stuck out for me and I thought I would answer now for you uh, was about the use of acid toners. This seems to be a really kind of on-trend product that everybody wants to use at the moment. And it was really along the lines of, should I use one every day? Should it be after every cleanse? There's quite a lot of confusion. Now, we at You and Your Skin are huge fans of exfoliation and we use many different methods for exfoliation. Toners per se have never really been something that I've been a huge fan of. Um, I think they're quite dated in as much as, you know, it's quite an old school way now of effectively cleansing the skin by doing the whole cleanse tone moisturise routine. And I think that's why these new acid toners have been kind of really brought to the forefront. It's a, a new kind of up and coming way of incorporating a traditional toner into your routine, but that has an acid base. So when we say acid, we're talking alpha hydroxy acid. So it could be glycolic, it could be lactic acid, it could be salicylic acid. My answer to the question then about how much you should use I'm sorry to say this is something that's quite bespoke to the individual, so it really does depend on your skin type, but also the skin conditions. So if you're somebody that has a lot of redness, a lot of hypersensitivity, um, I would actually say for you, using lots of acids on the skin isn't a great idea. So therefore, if you've got an acid toner, I would say actually once a week or even every, once every other week would be sufficient because you don't want to break down that protective kind of barrier on the skin even more and cause more redness and irritation. Um, general rule of thumb is during the winter months exfoliate two to three times a week. So I certainly wouldn't be recommending that everybody uses these after every single cleanse. Um, but it really is something I'd need to kind of have a look at the product, look at those ingredients. And I think that's really the whole point with skincare generally. Our belief is that it is very bespoke. There is no one size fits all. Um, but hopefully that's answered your question. So um, if, you know, if in doubt, err on the side of caution, go for two to three times a week um, and feel free to contact us on a more individual basis and we can have a look at that product um, and see if it's indeed right for you. So that's one of many questions. I'm going to be answering a few more this coming Saturday. So if you live in Norwich, Norfolk, the UK, um, and and you are fans of Norwich Fashion Week, myself and Louise Lace, who's a local fashion stylist, we're going to be doing an event um, called the Style and Skin Clinic at the St Giles House Hotel, 9.30 for a 10 o'clock start this Saturday the 12th of March um, and it's £20 a ticket, details are on Eventbrite and it's going to be just about this, so we're going to be busting some myths around skin health and style and answering a few more of your common skin health questions, so it will be great if we could uh, see a few more of you there, only a few tickets left so hopefully uh, you can bag one and uh, do keep sending questions through, always happy to answer them.